to win. <laughs> Just so something good would happen for our city. And after driving up to West Side Highway, my cell phone goes off. It's my brother Joe. Mm -hmm. Joe, what's the best piece of bad news? Mom just had a stroke. Great. An hour ago. I found her in the living room at the house. We're at Long Beach Hospital, the emergency room. Yeah, they're doing tests now, but it's, it's not good. So can you get her? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a, an hour and a half of traffic. Tell her that I'm coming. All we said. What else was there to say? We got out to the hospital, met with the doctor, who said to me, Yes, indeed, Mr. Trinchell, your mama just had a stroke. But if you're going to have a stroke, this is the one you want to have. <laughs> he explained it was a very healable place in her brain. He thought that she'd make a complete recovery. Great. But her left arm is weaker now. I'm not sure that's going to come back. I understand. She's very confused right now. Okay. And she's over there. and Joel's here. We're all here for Mom. Listen, it's good news. I just met with your doctor. He thinks you're going to make a complete recovery from the stroke. Isn't that great? She looked up at me with very confused eyes. And she spoke to me as if she was a little girl. Do I understand it, Sam? A better birth? Oh, that's... You have a bad headache, don't you? Yes, I do. So I held a good hand beside the back of her head when she said it hurt. I'll always take care of you. I'll always take care of you. Thank you. Then she stopped talking. She started staring straight ahead, silently, all the rest of that night, all the next day, staring straight ahead, silently, at night. I panicked. I ran to the doctor. Doc, what's going on with you? You tell me everything. Why isn't she speaking? You didn't tell me. Will you calm down, please? I know this is hard for all of you, but understand this. Your mom can talk if she wants to. She doesn't want to right now. She's angry. And she was. She was like furious. Furious that God had insulted her body.